Hey guys, welcome to a new LP. This is Time Crisis 2. Yes, the light gun game for the PS2, originally in the arcade. Now, I do have the, um... I do have the light gun, but apparently it doesn't work on HD TVs, which is a bit of an uh, annoyance. So, yeah, we're going to be playing this uh, arcade mode all the way through, hopefully. I get nine continues, so I'm pretty sure that'll be uh, simple enough. It's short, it's about two hours long. If, in fact, it probably isn't even two hours long, it's probably more like an hour long. Actually, now that I'm remembering it, this game is incredibly short. It's probably only like, um, half an hour? I think I was exaggerating this. Uh, I'm probably thinking of the sequel, which is Time Crisis 3, which is uh, much longer, and uh, I didn't play it as much. I do have it, and I also have Raising Storm for the PS3, which I might look into. But uh, yeah, I played this game the most. Beat it without uh, using a continue before, I believe. There's a few extra games, but what we want is the arcade here. Now the normal game options is four lives. Um, this is standard, and I'm just going to play on medium. I haven't played harder than medium, I think. But then again, I haven't really tried to. So let's just play one player here. Uh, you can set up uh, once you beat the game in order to use like uh, shotgun shots. Um, this one is like a machine gun and infinite bullets. But uh, I'll just stick with the normal. Uh, I don't, and basically, what you get if you beat um, this game without continuing is a mirror mode, which just swaps everything. It actually, really screwed me up because I played this game so much I had recognized where enemies and memorized where enemies spawned from. Oh, and I'll let you know right now, the story and the voice acting is hilariously bad. But I like games like this and House of the Dead. They were pretty good for, the, for their time. I didn't think this would be adapted for the PS2, honestly. Also, this, this guy with the uh, bowler hat has the most ridiculous voice it's ever. Me. It's amazing. Christy. I found some data about the satellite network. Haven't the agents left yet? Keith and Robert are on their way. No one can beat them. Keith and Robert? Yeah, the voice acting is terrible. <laughs> well, well, it appears we have a guest. Looks like we caught you just in time. And the lip syncing isn't much better. Problematic. To say the least. <laughs> a punch like that and you think you're going to conquer the world. Psych <laughs> I, I think it might have been cut short there. Um, I didn't touch anything, but uh, this game might be a bit old, so I don't know if it uh, has problems reading uh, the videos or stuff like that. I have no clue, honestly. But uh, yeah, the basic game is you dark in cover and uh, you shoot people. And try not to get shot yourself. Now, there are different uh, enemies you can fight here. I'm just fighting the blue guys. There was a green army dude that you can see there, which are a lot more... Um, uh, more of a threat. Those red guys are probably your biggest threat in this game because they can aim extremely well. Yeah, these guys. And you can just dock into cover to reload. The army guys have machine guns and rocket launchers as well, so they're pretty, pretty bad too. Now, if you hit this truck here, I remember, you get a bonus and you don't need to take out those guys. The blue guys can occasionally get a hit on you that may, may injure you. The, see that when I dodged out the way of that red guy's bullets? Yeah, that's basically him. Um, I also missed a yellow guy over there, which is a bonus. He was running in the back. Um, bonus, all, all, all it really does is give you points, which I don't really care about. You also have a time limit, which is why it's called Time Crisis. Even though you would probably never have a time limit normally <laughs> on this. Right, so you get three stages, and each part has three areas in them, so... This is the first area of the first stage. These guys are rocket launchers, can be annoying if you don't take them out quick. You just have to hit the boss guy up here. He also has a very annoying laugh. So you can tell if they're going to hit you if you... Wow, that guy wasn't dying there. There was area one. Generally, they only take like two minutes. A minute 55. 
Now in this next area, you can get a bonus if I manage to hit the boss guy four times and knock his hat off each time. I'll get a bonus area instead of fighting the boss of this this part. So I'm gonna try and do that, but it is quite difficult. Obviously, if you were using the white gun, you would obviously just point at the screen, but I have this crosshair on this. I don't think the white guys or the um, grey guys later on are any better. Yeah, I knocked off his hat. Uh, than um, the blue guys at shooting. I honestly don't know. I haven't lost a life yet. I believe... yeah, there's a red guy up there. Yeah, they can they can fire really well, so they're pretty much going to be your your worst enemy here. Another one there. Whoa! I think I knocked off his hat there. I can't tell. <laughs> yeah, so as long as you're trigger happy, this might be the game for you. Don't hit your teammate, by the way. He will um, make you lose points, but your teammate can kill shit. Basically, your computer won't help you at all in one player mode. He's really bad. I think the boss has another shot at you after this part. I'll get the uh, other guy. There we go. And you. Get the two ninjas and get you again. Right, I think I've knocked off his hat three times, so I should be able to do it once more to get the bonus area. Basically, you get a bunch of uh, yellow guys, which are the bonus guys to shoot instead of this tank. You get a machine gun to take it out, but. Uh, Obviously, uh, the bonus guys are much easier. You might get hit on the boss. Right. Don't worry if you miss the first time. You should come back. Or maybe he doesn't. Okay, I may have screwed that up. I thought he came back, but maybe not. Yeah, it looks like I missed the secret area. Oh well. You basically go off to the left here, and you see that you saw those yellow guys. They give you 5,000 points each. Uh, well, at least I get to show off the boss here, which is basically this giant tank thing. Basically, you've got a machine gun now with an infinite shot, so just keep shooting at this thing. It's not too difficult. Don't even bother with the guys on the other side, by the way. And also, watch out for the shots that can quite easily hit you. When you take it out, though, you'll be done. I'm doing pretty well so far. Right, okay. So, who are those two? Where's the girl? They took her to General Diaz, son. We gotta stop them now! Yes, sir. Ah, uh, yeah, this part. Yeah, this is quite a fun part, I would say. If there was a yellow guy over there, I missed. Damn it. I, I, I don't really remember the secrets too well in this game. Right, this is an annoying part. Uh, these things, they basically just shoot at you, but uh, take a couple shots out. No, it's actually the next part that's more annoying, when he starts shooting you. Now, you can hit your teammate quite easily here, and it is quite annoying to hit these uh, guys. It'd probably be easier with the gun, but like I said, if anyone knows how to get the gun working with an HDTV, then please let me know. Right, okay. You. Notice your time will get extended every so often. I believe you only lose one life if your time runs out. These guys are they're very bad at fucking aiming. And these water guys. I don't think you ever see them again after this point. Like I said, this is a pretty short game. You could just dodge them. But uh, obviously that gives you less points. I don't really care about points. Yeah, fuck you. But, uh, yeah, I missed the f oh, geez. I forgot about that guy. Can't hit this guy for shit. <laughs> there we go. Can't hit that guy on the side, yeah. Yeah, I'm much better with the gun, but uh, the controller still works a, a bit. Yeah, screw you. Okay, I think this is actually uh, the easier part. Okay. Maybe not. There we go. Yeah! That's area one and um, stage one dealt with, I should say. That was easier than I remembered to be. In. I'm eventually gonna get shot. Don't worry. Um, there's. Did I really press something and? Right. Okay. The story you don't really care about it anyway. But damn it.
Let me put my controller down. Yeah, it just skips them automatically. Right, um, there's something wrong with my controller or something. Sorry, guys. If you do want to see the movies, I don't know why you would want to, because the story is terrible. <laughs> and the voice acting is pretty much just laughable. But, you know, if you, I think there will be some um, other place that will have the videos. Essentially, you got this corporation that's, like, evil and shit. And, uh, yeah. I forget the name of that first guy. But, uh, the two... The names of... Your characters are like Robert Baxter and what's the other name? The, oh, jeez, the other guy, Robert Baxter and Keith Martin's. Da there, there you go. Oh, damn it! Never saw that ninja. Ah, well, eventually. See, blue guys can still get uh, hits on on you that will hit you, but generally they are pretty worthless. Can't believe that ninja hit me, man. I was too busy, like. Yeah. They've got to reload, so just give it some time. I was too busy f focusing on the yellow bonus guy. Oh yeah, this part. A bunch of army dudes will come out at you. They're not too difficult. And you get a machine gun for this next part. Where you basically need to take this guy out. I wait for a while before I uh, go in. Basically you just got to wait for the tree to come at you. And uh, these rocket launchers will come at you, but this part's pretty cool. Just dodge and keep it. Right, I don't know if I'm going up or... Uh, apparently I get to stay below. When I was playing before, I was staying at the uh, top here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa! Whoa, that was pretty tricky. Am I really trying to hit these guys up here? What about my guys down here? Fucking ninjas! Those ninjas are like the worst enemy. Apart from, well, I don't know. The other guys are pretty bad. Ah, oh, right. Shit, I can't hit the. Uh, I don't think I can hit the uh, belt from here. Basically, you can hit the belt and uh, cause these guys to fall down if you're on the top floor. I think. Oh no, I can still do it. Okay. And in this next area, I believe there's some barrels for you to hit that can quickly kill these guys. And that's area one. Okay, let's do this. The train section is one of my favorite parts in this. Uh, this guy will come out and basically fire at you, but then he'll go away. <laughs> I like to be safe than sorry, you know? More safe than sorry, I could say. So, looks like I have taken... Oh, fuck, I got hit by that guy, damn it. I've taken I've taken the other route apparently. Oh, you can't! Oh wow, he almost got me again as well. Well, I have no shame in continuing. This is a hard game if you're doing it on one uh, credit. Oh yeah, this part. Uh, basically, what you want to do is as soon as you. Ah, oh, damn it! I missed him. There we go. I hit one of them. If you hit both of them, you'll go to this other section. Uh, which may have a few different guys, but uh, oh, there you are. There you are. Gotcha. Right, I don't know if I'm going to jump across or stay on this path. Yeah, I'm going to stay on this path. You got these things annoying you as well. Whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Army dude, calm yourself. Alright, that red guy was annoying. Anyone else? Up here. Right, okay. Ah, train section. Yeah, uh, these, these parts. Where you basically hitting these guys. Yeah, you get a, a bonus there. Hit the gun repeatedly. And the guy on top of the gun. It basically... Oh jeez, that almost got me. I uh, keep hitting the gun and eventually get some more points. This part's annoying. Oh fuck. Walk away, I don't need to hit that guy again.
Oh, jeez. Almost for I almost forgot about those guys coming out. That's area two. Okay, we aren't doing too bad. I haven't had to continue yet. Are you gonna skip? That scene? Here's our boss, by the way. Oh my god, voice acting. So I hope the video looks okay. This this one's fairly easy, you just gotta keep hitting him and uh, 